Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you guys some of the things that I have been loving um, since having a newborn. My name's Jamie, if you guys are new. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe down below and we can get to know each other a little bit better. Welcome back guys. Um, like I said, my name is Jamie, if you're new, and I have a brand new newborn right now. And so I thought it would be fun to share with you guys some of the things that I have been loving with her. So this is my fourth Earthside baby. So I wanted to share with you guys um, some of the things that I have been really liking, kind of in comparison to the other newborns that I have had. And so yeah, I was really excited to just tell you guys the things that I've been loving and I've been using on a daily basis. All right guys, so the first thing I'm gonna share with you is very practical, and they are just pre-folds. Pre-folds for Burt bibs, they're super thick, they're very inexpensive, and they're white, and it's like, what the heck? So, there you go, pre-folds I have been loving for spit up and uh, leaking and all of that kind of stuff. Next is just an original, you guys. These sleep, these little sleep gowns. They have an opening on the bottom. These I've loved for all my babies. My girls, my boys, I've loved them. Because in the middle of the night when you're changing butts, you just pull this up, like it's so easy. You just pull them up and you change them and there's no snaps, there's no zips, there's no nothing. Um, super, super easy, throw on some socks, swaddle them and they're nice and warm. Speaking of swaddles, I got these swaddles from a company called Maybe Baby. I think I found them on Instagram. Um, everybody will be linked below that I can link for you guys. These are Jersey swaddles. So, so nice. This is like a nice mustardy brown color, which I felt like it was so nice for the fall time. As well as the normal muslin swaddle. I mean, you can't get any softer than a nice muslin blanket. This is from Little Unicorn, I believe. And it's just so, so nice. Look at that print, you guys. So soft and gentle, so pretty. The nose Frida, baby nose Frida. Now, so many people are like, that is disgusting. Um, it just looks nasty, and I will tell you guys, it does look kind of gross, <laughs> but it works amazing. Basically, it has like two ends. One end is like this little like, I don't know, syringe thing that you put inside your baby's nose. The other end is something that you suck through, but there is a filter, so you're not getting boogers and snot in your mouth or anything like that. But you're basically being able to pull out, suck out boogies out of your baby's nose. And I feel like those bulb syringe things are so nasty. They harbor bacteria and mold and they are and they don't even do that great of a job. The Nose Frida is the way to go. The next favorite that I have is just one of those noise makers. Um, the one that we have is from Cloud B, I think is what it's called. And it's it has this attachment where you can just like Velcro it to the car seat and that's actually where we leave it. We have it on our car seat. She doesn't seem to really like the car seat very much. So we put her in the car seat and then we turn on like the white noise or there's one that makes sounds of like birds chirping and just cool stuff and she always gets super excited like you can tell she's listening so intently when I turn it on and I have had one of those for all of my kids because I swear by them I feel like they help so much all right guys and the last item I'm gonna be sharing with you is this beautiful Moses basket from Wendy and designs I was scrolling through Instagram and I had noticed these Moses baskets these beautiful bassinet style baskets that people were putting their babies in and I discovered Wendy Ann um, who makes these she's got her Etsy shop and um, she's a Christian I was checking out her Instagram account and I reached out to her actually and um, asked her if she would be willing to send me one in exchange for me to share it with you guys and she was absolutely um, a joy to work with and so she sent me this beautiful basket and um, I've been putting Ingrid in it it is so soft I will tell you the the pad that I lay her in I was so surprised when I put her in it the first time because I was like this is super super soft if I was a little itty bitty baby, I would love to be laying on this thing. Um, not only is the basket beautiful and portable because it's got handles and you can take it all over the house, but it's super, super comfy. The linen that's inside of it is like an organic blend linen and um, it's just beautiful. And so it, I feel like it's perfect for pictures, for newborn pictures. It's practical because you can take it all over the house, you can take it places with you, um, but it's also super comfy and soft. And that I think is like the most important thing when you're 
you're putting an itty bitty little newborn in it. So I am definitely gonna link Wendy's um, shop down below for you guys so you can go and support um, another woman. So definitely go check out Wendy. Wendy, thank you so much for sending me this. It's so beautiful and I love putting Ingrid in it. All right guys, so those are my newborn favorites. I feel like nowadays there's so much stuff that people um, you know, are, are plastering everywhere and advertising for and it can feel really overwhelming knowing like what do you actually use on a daily basis? What's something that is practical? And these are all things that I use on a daily basis. So I hope that you guys enjoyed it. As always, all of the links will be linked down below and Wendy's link will be down below. I hope you're doing well and you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys later.